I had a subscriber ask me, are you using pinhole pipe in place of knife cut? And the answer is yes. We haven't really gone public about it. We haven't talked too openly about it, and I want to do that now. We were able to do a limited run this year. This is a machine that was built in the 1970s. These machines have been decommissioned. They're completely worn out. They were machines of high maintenance, and they become obsolete. Knife cut replaced pinhole. Pinhole does a lot of things really, really well. And when given the option, I do prefer pinhole over knife cut. That's not to say that knife cut doesn't perform great because it does. But pinhole does do some things for us that it does really, really well. So I like the fact that you have all these little perforations, 360 degrees. Look at how much area of this pipe is perforated. I like that about pinhole. In place of knife cut for leach fields and for any type of drains where you're adding normally knife cut to the end so that the drain line doesn't hold water at the pop-up, the different things that you've seen us do where we're going to put catch basins on a French drain pipe, it's now going to be pinhole. So I just wanted to go public and talk about that because the subscriber asked because he started noticing it in our videos, and he's right. What happened was I thought maybe this run was going to be a one-off. As it turns out, they're going to be able to run this continuous for French drain man. It can't be to the masses because the machine is very limited. It's tired and they're doing all they can to keep it working for our orders. Having said that, we've brought in another order of pipe. We have another order of pinhole. I wanted everybody to be aware that for as long as we can, as long as this machine will continue to run for us, we're going to offer this pipe to you. If you appreciate the products that we're bringing to the market for the homeowner, for the contractor, give us a thumbs up. It shows me you appreciate what we're doing. I'm your host, Robert Sherwood, and until the next video.